Hey kids, wanna see the pipeline? What's a pipeline? Uh, I don't feel like explaining. Anyway, I got some new pictures here, sent by Sven the Illustrator, and he was like, don't do this, we have important work, don't even look at this, so I think I'm gonna do this one maybe, or this one, ah, he has bent arms. This one seems easy. Okay, these are podcasts and things. I don't need those while I'm talking. I don't really need the background. So I drew this in layers, so it's much easier. This is one layer. Let's rename everything. Body. Uh, these dots have no reason to be separate from the body because they're all together. So merge down. Eyebrows, very important. Eyes, mouth, I guess, uh, let's say it's mouth, arm, left, I know it's technically the right arm, but it's on my left, moustache, so we have these layers, if we had more, I would probably set them next to each other, like arm goes with arm, what goes in front and give them numbers, but right here with just five or six layers, it's not important. What is important is that every layer needs to be cropped to content. So this layer is this big. This layer is this big. This layer is this big. Fun! So much fun. I mean, I do it on autopilot, listen to a podcast or documentary, and all the layers are ready. Export Layers plugin for GIMP. It's an excellent plugin, which you can find on the link in your favorite search engine if you type in GIMP export layers something something. Making folders very important and it's exporting. Status bars, your favorite bars in the pandemic. Save my own file with my own names, the original made in Procreate, send here and layers go to the Dropbox because I like complicating stuff. I just realized Blobman is a terrible name because tons of characters put, could be called Blobman. But okay, we have a bunch of layers, lovely. Find the folder with images, yes this is the folder, save the new file and we're ready to assemble. All I need to do now is put all the layers where they are needed. It's usually good to have a reference image in the background, but this is pretty simple and I can't really miss. I mean, what am I going to, if I put eyebrows here or here, not that it matters much. It's about how it moves. I like it better without the mouth. Time for rigging, but you're gonna see that some other time. I hope you enjoyed this.